Thanks for watching the video from JoyFed.com. Today we will show you how to use a computer controller wire stripping machine. First, let me introduce the parts of the machine. From left to right, the first one, roller gap adjustment, to adjust the gap between the outlet rollers. Number two, wire outlet conveying rollers. If you turn anti-clockwise, you can lift the rollers. And if you turn clockwise, it will take down the rollers. Number three, wire outlet rollers. Number four, knife rack assembly. Number five, conduit pipe assembly. Number six, wire inlet rollers. Number seven, wire inlet conveying rollers. If you turn clockwise, you can lift the rollers. Uh, if you turn anti-clockwise, you can take down the rollers. Number eight, wire inlet roller gap adjustment uh, to adjust the gap between the inlet rollers. Number nine, wire straighter. Number ten, operating panel. Number eleven, LCD screen. Now let's learn about the panel. Turn on the machine and the screen will show the original data. For the panel, the up and the down arrow are the cursor for you to choose the function. And the plus and the minus are the ones you can add or minus the data. The green run key is to start the machine. And the stop key is not for stop. If you press stop key, it will cut one time to test the parameter setting. And the E stop is to stop in emergency. The number of keys are for you to enter the data. And the decimal point key has another function. You can press this key to turn on or turn off the middle strip function. The ruler is for you to check the stripping result. Let me introduce the parameter on the LCD screen. PRG is a program. SPD is speed. NEN is wire length. AMT amount. A-C wire head. A-S head stripping. B-C wire tail. B-S tail stripping. TOT quota, GRP quantity per, per bunch, DLY delay, M-S needle stripping, DIA diameter of wire core, RTL knife retreating. Let's start with full stripping. If the head is stripping, is large or equals the wire head, it indicates full stripping. But if the head stripping is smaller than the wire head, it, it indicates half stripping. Before starting, we need to set the parameter first. About the parameter setting, you can refer to the manual, which has a detailed explanation. After setting the parameter, press the run key to start the machine. Let's check the results. 
The head stripping is 10, and the total length is 60. Press E stop to return to parameter setting. For half stripping, we need to change the data of wire head, head stripping, and wire tail, tail stripping. Please note that half strip stripping is the head stripping is smaller than wire head. Tail stripping is smaller than tail, wire tail. Press run key to start the machine. Let's check the result of half stripping. The half stripping is 7. The total length is 60. Press E stop to return to parameter setting. For middle strip, stripping, we need to choose 60 to 89 for the program. Press decimal point. You can turn on or turn off middle stripping function. For middle stripping, it is 5. And we have a total 10 position for middle stripping. And now we set only 4 position. Twenty means the distance from wire tail is twenty. Forty means the distance from wire tail is forty. We must lift the wire outlet rollers when middle stripping. Press run key to start middle stripping. Let's check the result of middle stripping. This is wire head. This is wheel tail. Wheel head is 7. And wheel tail is also 7. The first position from wheel tail of middle street is 20. Second one is 40. Third one 60. Fourth one 80. Middle stripping is 5.